Hey guys, what's up? In this video, we'll be going through how we can fix Windows Hello not working on Windows 10. So without any further ado, let's get right into it. So the first solution is to set up TPM that is Trusted Platform Module Management Tool on your device. So hit Windows key along with R to open up the run dialog and then type in tpm.msc. Now once the Trusted Platform Module is open, navigate to Action and then hit Prepare the TPM. Once done, click Restart button and follow the instructions at Startup and then see if Windows uh, Hello now works on this device or not. Now the solution number two is to authorize the pin login using the registry editor. So hit Windows key along with R to open up the run dialog and then type in REG Edit. Once the registry editor is open, navigate to the registry that is computer, H key underscore for local underscore machine and then software then go to policies and then navigate to microsoft then windows and then system now here look for an entry named allow domain pin logon so in case you don't find it right click on the panel and then click on new and then go to d word 32 bit value now here create the key with name allow domain pin logon and then right click on the key to edit it and then in the value data type in 1 and in the base value select hexadecimal and then hit ok. Now you can restart your PC by going to start menu and then power button and restart it to see if the problem is resolved or not. Now the final solution that we have is to reinstall drivers for biometric and imaging devices. So hit windows key along with R to open up the run dialog and then type in devmgmt.msc to open up the device manager and now uninstall any drivers for imaging devices or biometric devices and then to reinstall these drivers uh, google your device name along with manufacturer name and then look for the drivers and then reinstall them on your device and you can also click scan for hardware changes option and it will uh, check for devices without drivers and reinstall them automatically so in case the problem still persists you can move on to the fourth solution which is to update windows so the fourth solution is to update your windows to the latest version so hit windows key and then go to the settings option and then in the settings option navigate to the windows update option and then click the button check for updates so once it shows any updates uh, make sure that you install it and see if the issue still persists or not so we hope that the solution would be helpful for you guys make sure that you hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to our youtube channel we'll see you in the next one take care bye